Uh, you know, next year there's going to be an election. I don't know if you guys have heard <laughs> about this thing. It's coming. And uh, there's going to be a Senate battle. We know Gallego's in it. We're not quite sure about uh, the Democrat that is now an independent occupying one of the Senate seats. But there will be a Republican in it. And boy, oh boy, she is already the rightful governor of Arizona. Carrie Lake now <laughs> wants to be the senator uh, for this great state. Well, she could lose that race, too, because she ain't going to win that, that race. Uh, all she has to do is uh, just keep talking about what she talks about. No one is better than, than Carrie Lake at, at uh, alienating Republicans. No one is better than Carrie Lake at alienating a large number of independent voters. She is going to run her mouth like she did the last time and tell certain people not to vote for her. And Blake Masters is probably going to beat her. I think Arizona Republicans are too smart for uh, Carrie Lake. I, I I know that some of you out there uh, are conservatives, and um, but if you want someone who's going to win, well then I, you know uh, don't vote for Carrie Lake because she's been a total disaster. She walks around mic'd up. She was at the airport the other day. She started a fight with Gallego. It really is kind of silly to think that you could trust someone who just read a prompter for her whole life and was very good at it. But to run the state, Arizona said no. To be a senator, I don't think Arizona is going to say yes. I think I think there are a lot of, listen, I, I, I think your sheriff who you like is a much better candidate than Carrie Lake. I think that Blake Masters, who almost won, is a much better candidate than Carrie Lake. Carrie Lake can't win a general election. She's kryptonite to general elections. She's a joke. So, I mean, if guess if you want to vote for her, go ahead. I, I just thought Republicans wanted to win this time around. So yeah. that's just me. I, you know.